Candid Sports. Welcome to MetLife Stadium, home of the New York Giants and Jets. No, they aren't really relevant, are they? Home of the New York Giants. Did you know the New York Giants are one of the original eight National Football League teams? Of course you didn't. And when America was suffering through the Great Depression, the New York Giants were winning championships and kept the good times rolling. Recognize this guy? He was the offensive coordinator. And this one, the defensive coordinator. Hard to picture the Giants losing, huh? But they did occasionally, including the 1958 championship game, called by some as the greatest game ever played. Glad the New York Giants could play a part in the popularity of the National Football League. Then the Giants took off for a while. A long while. And they were still around, like a crappy dad who leaves town but still sends Christmas cards. And like him, the Giants would resurface from time to time, with plays like... Seems like something like this happened another time. The Giants don't seem to be handling division rivalries too well, are they? Till that. You don't need to see the outcome. You've seen it in slow motion 10,000 times. Led by Bill Parcells, the Giants finally started winning again, sneaking in a Super Bowl in the 1980s in a year that the 49ers took off. Then needed a Scott Norwood miss to win another. Then needed this miracle to win another Super Bowl. Then needed another comeback to beat the Patriots again. No, forget that one. So wait, the New York Giants have beaten Tom Brady in the Super Bowl twice, but lost to Trent Dilfer? Probably something to do with the difference between... and... And now the Giants are back in 2018, with an explosive rookie running back they're hoping is more Barry Sanders than Reggie Bush. One of the most explosive wideouts in the game, and Eli Manning, who can finally say he is the greatest Manning currently playing in the National Football League. So enjoy New York. No, wait. The Giants play in New Jersey. No one really enjoys New Jersey, but you can still see New York. And enjoy the game, and watch football the way it was meant to be watched. Where the Giants quarterback will either throw for 320 yards and 4 touchdowns, or 32 yards and 4 interceptions, with not a lot in between.